by Vinicek. Good hand to eye right there as Vinicek was able to bat that one over the corner. Now a chance in front shot and a point blank stop by McLaren. As he'll say, relentless down low, trying to get that one back. Wildcats on a good pass up ahead from Richard toward the net. Loose puck and what a stop by McLaren. home and McLaren gets enough of it there as Lucci had a fantastic opportunity Vitacek big hit and lots of speed on this line as that puck is cleared away Forche after it on the back end trying to tuck it oh big stop by McLaren Jay picks it up fans don't like it Forche down the right wing a load of shot bad stop McLaren he'll shut the door well that's pretty much what he's done all night he's been absolutely rock steady here I'm not sure if I know where the you see penalty shot on that. Or? A little <laughs> chop, a little chop on uh, Forche. Still got a pretty good, uh, pretty good shot off, but uh, he gets the penalty shot. Uh, most dangerous Moncton forward out there to take it. And Cole McLaren, as he's been all night, rock solid. He'll stop another one. Yeah. Puck bounces back toward the line. Spence there to retrieve it. He'll send it up the right wing side. Heavy check by Horvat. Stammer. Throwing that one rink wide. Olsen will drive in down the left wing side. He's got it back behind the net. Trying to center out front. It was broken up by Tessier. Tessier poking at it. Centering pass. Stewart a shot. He scores. That'll be Cole McLaren. And Jacob Stewart has tied this one up for the Wildcats early in the third period with his first of the season. Well, Jacob Stewart becoming the First Wildcat not named Vinny LaBelle to find the back of the net this year after the Wildcats were shut out by the Titan on Sunday. Stewart picking up that pass in the slot area. Good little centering feed right there. And it's a good shot off and it's a tie hockey game here in period three. Loose puck, Loshing after it. Back toward the line for DeYoung. He'll let a shot go. Bouncy puck loose in front. What a stop by McLaren. Cole McLaren denying Forche in tight. Extended that pad to keep Ube, rather, a swan force the turnover. Now back up top to Horvath. Bouncing puck. James Swan on the back end. Let's it go. Loose puck. They score. Austin has got his second of the season. He'll follow up on that one, and the Moose back on top. A lot a start to the season for Cole Faustin, and what a shift for this line. Haven't seen a whole lot of ice here tonight, but giving the Moose sets coaching staff a reason to have them back out there. Energy shift, and it's Faustin delivering. After some great work from Swan and Dubé, just kind of thrown toward the net there by Swan and Faustin lurking. He's got his second goal of the season as Swan just put it on net on the backhand and Faustin right there and knocks it home. Goal of the season. He's picked up a point now in every game so far. Contrast to last year. He's got his team on top, but a chance in front. They score Jacob Stewart. For the second time in this hockey game, tying it up, left alone in the doorstep, and he'll beat McLaren. Two for Stewart. A 2-2 score here in period three. The veteran Jacob Stewart answering right back for the Moncton Wildcats, and that did not take long at all. Alexi Daniel trying to get a shot off. It was off the leg, and then a pass out front, and against Stewart all alone there. Not a whole lot McLaren could do is Stewart with plenty of time. Nobody on him. So Stewart will come right back out. He's flanked by Langlois and Alexi Daniel. The Vidic Dao picks up the loose puck to Fortier. Let's a missile go. It's up and over the net, but Bernier will pick up the puck and Knocked off it by Dubé, but gets it right back. Dishes up. What a stop by McLaren. Are you kidding? 
and out. Orr trying to swat one in. That was knocked down by Spence. Up ahead, Bernier toward the middle for Forche. Dropped off. A shot they score. Bernier streaking in down the right wing side. Takes a great pass. Gets a good shot off. And the Moncton Wildcats have got their first lead of the evening. Well, Gabrielle Bernier has got the Wildcats up three to two here in the third period. Special moment for him, his first career Q League goal. A terrific release on that one. And he's going to get that over the arm of uh, Cole McLaren. Well played shot, great pass from Forche. And the Mooseheads now. It's in front for Stewart. What a diving play by Dubé to get in that lane. The net still empty. Olsen spins and scores. He'll let it go into the empty net. And Olsen with his first career Q League goal into the empty cage. And looks like he just iced that one for the Moncton Wildcats. Zachary LaRue incensed out there. Some words for the officials. And LaRue fired up as he comes off the ice. Again, he thought that thought that uh, there should have been